It's Outback Bowl Media Day. We're here live at Haluba Hall. Coach Paterno addressed the local media this afternoon. We caught up with several Nittany Lions for their thoughts about playing the Florida Gators on New Year's Day at the Outback Bowl in Tampa. Uh, obviously, there's been a lot of uh, ups and downs throughout the year. Um, fortunately, there was a couple games we kind of let slip away. Um, you know, hopefully within the next you know, couple weeks uh, during bowl practice and things like that, we're going to learn how to play a complete football game. And you know, at times we've showed it, and uh, we've been pretty, we've played pretty well when we did. So, um, you know, well, I felt we had a lot of ups, you know, and yeah, we had downs, but I think we were very resilient in the way that we responded with those downs, you know. And that's that's what you really want, you know. As a senior, you want your team and, and your guys and the underclassmen to, to, to really rally and, and to pl play up to their potential. You know? And I felt we did that towards the latter part of the season. We played you know, some big time teams on the road. We played Michigan State here. And, uh, but I feel like that's the way we want it. We want to play big time teams uh, year in and year out. That's why we come to Penn State. Like, uh, through the way, I think we had a lot of success. Um, learned from a lot of mistakes we made early. Um, and I think we've grown a lot as a team, and, and I'm interested to see how we can put all that together on January 1st. Yeah, I think at times we came out and showed that we can really play, and uh, well, there's a lot of potential on this team. Um, I, I think beating Michigan was, was a big thing. Anytime you beat a, a big-name school like them, it's, it, it kind of stays in your mind a little bit. I can't think of a specific play that's a highlight. You know, just go, being in Beaver Stadium every single time, that's, that's a highlight in itself. You know, every time you get to play at home, Ohio State's fun to play at going down to Alabama. Those are all just good memories, and obviously you, we want to get those wins. They make them even better memories. But, you know, just being in front of the fans and, and just being with my teammates. Uh, probably either Northwestern or Michigan games. So are both big-time games, you know, national TV against solid teams and played really well uh, at least second half against Northwestern and, uh, and got big wins and, you know, the 400, that was, that was pretty special. For several Nittany Lions, Coach Paterno's 400th victory was their season highlight. Let's take a look to see what some of them had to say about that momentous occasion. I mean, to me, I think Joe's 400th was a, a big milestone for us. To be a part of that um, really meant a lot to, to myself, the team. Um, it's something that you know, we'll look back on 20 years from now and, and really be proud um, that we were a part of that and we were able to make that happen for Coach. Just to uh, see the intensity of that stadium the night that Coach Paterno got his 400th win. Uh, it's big. Um, we're going to go down to history as being the team that got Coach Paterno's 400 win, and uh, that's something very special that you're going to cherish for the rest of your life. It meant a lot. I mean, obviously, we, it was, we were having a tough game. We, we stuck together like we've been doing all season. We came back in the second half, and, uh, you know, just to be a part of that for him, for us, so, and we'll be able to talk, that, talk about that for the rest of our lives, which is pretty special. That, that, was, that was huge, you know, it was something that we wanted to get for him, and even though he downplays it a lot, you know, it's, it, it was kind of a goal for us to, to get that for him because it's such a big accomplishment and to be a part of it was, was really, really a blessing and it was really cool. Well, that was just such a great feeling and to know that we're going to be part of history and in my opinion, the best um, win Joe, Joe's ever had just because it's his 400th, it's his, you know, it's his uh, longest, you know, so um, yeah, I, I feel like we're a part of history and, you know, no one can take that from us. Stay tuned to GoPSUSports.com, your one-stop shop to everything you need to know about Penn State and the Outback Bowl. We will have plenty of written and video coverage leading up to the New Year's Day clash with the Gators. We traveled to Tampa for the contract signing. We're here today at Outback Bowl Media Day, and beginning December 26th, we'll be on-site live from Tampa. Stay tuned to GoPSUSports.com.